he started talking about this incident that he witnessed. He started telling me that uh, there was a cover-up. Drugs and uh, officials cover up. <laughs> he couldn't believe it. From iHeart Podcasts. It's like the police knew. It's like they knew who he was before they got here. A story about money, power, and corruption at the places we should trust the most. The medical school dean at USC was leading a secret double life. Is he breathing right now? Yes, he's absolutely breathing. I'm a doctor, actually. Like, there's no way that that guy's a doctor. I'm Paul Pringle, and I'm an investigative reporter for the LA Times. Harriet's not someone who's rattled, but there was something about the call that rattled her. This is the story of an investigation that starts in a hotel room in Pasadena, California, and reaches all the way to the top of two of the most powerful institutions in the city of Los Angeles. When people fall in line, they fall in line. Only a month or two after the investigation began, I received some strange visitors at my house. Hey, how did you find this out? How did you link us together? There were actually several instances that, looking back, I realized, oh, everyone knew. This is Fallen Angels, a story of California corruption. As an investigative reporter, every story could be your last. I had to get this story published, otherwise it would just betray why I'm a journalist in the first place. He was just like real aggressive, like, let's go, let's get to the bottom of this. Hey man, I've given you everything I could possibly give you. We're always going to have predators. It's the good people who stand by and do nothing that allow them to flourish. Listen to Fallen Angels, a story of California corruption, starting March 28th on the iHeartRadio app, Apple Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts.